Hey everybody, it's Michelle with Comfy Cozy Living. Welcome back to the rest of my uh, Goodwill haul from Friday night. I will have a lot of vintage Christmas on this one and I hope you will enjoy it. So what else have we got here? Oh, this is not Christmas, but <laughs> this is a great find. And this will be super to have um, when the um, when summertime runs rolls around. This will be cool to have. I'm, I might not want to part with it, but I probably will. Big old red, white, and blue thermos. This one is not. I don't think it's by Aladdin. Let me see. It's by Universal. Yeah, Hartford, Connecticut. Anyway, it's really big, and I did not check the inside of it. It's it's rather relatively clean. I think it's clean enough, but I can't really tell. So anyhow, very cool. Has a little dent in it. Doesn't bother me at all. At all. Oh, there's a little more Easter left here. Some, um, oh yeah, I just bought this mixed bag, which I'm going to try to take this out because I don't want it to get any more bent up. It's a cute little, uh, I think it's just a hanging decoration. I'm going to try to flatten it out. And here's why I would have bought this, probably, for the flocked bunny. Look how cute he is. Oh, so cute. Oh. Now, they, they must have, like, had these sticker sets. 1988, where you tried to put the stickers on the eggs yourself instead of, somebody probably thought, hey, this is a great idea. For people that don't want to mess with dye. So that's cute. That is a cute idea, actually. And here's another one. And then there's some picks in here. Those are cool. Orange glitter. Here's another orange glitter in here. There's the purple glitter one. There's some other pink. There's, oh, there's a, a butterfly. Oh, that's neat. Cute. Purple. Here's a little chick. Now, this is made in China, but this might be an older one. And I feel like this did something. So I'll be looking into this. It does have a cute little applique on it. It's cute. There's this cute little foil looking, probably was an insert to some candy possibly. Several different um, eggs and such. Oh, here's a, uh, this is a new order. This is from a store in, uh, well, you guys can know if I said it, but that's cute. That was in here. And some more picks. There's a little, probably fell off of some little big gear. And another little thing. Not sure what that is. Nothing in these eggs. And then most of them are not together anyhow. And then there's a little um, pansy pick. So, you know, some springy things, but mainly I bought it for the, um, uh, mainly I bought it for the, yes, Bella Hush. Whoops. And there was this. This is a little heavy, but it's chalkware. 
and it is mushrooms. So if you have a, I love mushrooms too, but I do not have, I am not buying anything for myself too much lately. Um, just the certain things that I absolutely either A, collect, or B, just like love, 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 love. And this I, I like, but I don't have to have it. Um, I have a lot that I was buying before, but I don't know whatever I'm going, so I don't need more stuff. But this is a cool, um, it's got the little hook, cool little, uh, well, not little, uh, chalkware. Mushroom while hanging. And I got some um, wrapping paper because there was so much, but I didn't, I didn't get all of it. I couldn't, but there's that snowman. And then this, I love the colors, the blue and the green with all the different designs on it. And I love this one, the candy canes, this one with the silver, this is a Hallmark. This is Tuffle, Tuttle, Tuttle Press. I love that. I got two of those and I really like this one. This is a Kmart one. So those are super cool. And then I got this. This is a um, round, I believe. Yeah, round. A round tablecloth. Really nice, like a patchwork looking style with the cute colors and the cute designs on it. Has does has bells, flowers, uh, wreath. Our pine cones, candy canes, presents, mistletoe. I don't know if I missed anything, but it's really neat. It's got checks and stripes and little. It's really nice. I like the color of it a lot. So this one's a good one, I think. And. This will be a good, good, bleh, good, good, good and great all at one time. I can't speak, but this will be a great piece for one of my um, boho sales. I mean, I'd love to keep it, but you know, Bella would have her way with these tassels. So it's a super cool pillow cover. Very boho. Love it. I mean, I could pull the tassels off, I suppose, but you know, I probably wouldn't, wouldn't do that. So then this is, I think this will be like a really cool, um, present for like somebody who collected this stuff when they were a kid. Um, I, this will probably be more when a, for one of my local shows because of the size of it. Not that it couldn't be shipped, but you know, it says comic book, I forgot what it said, Corral. C-O-R-R-A-L. And so it's, um, um, I don't know if it's supposed to be, it's not the Lone Ranger, but I guess it's just, you know, cool for a little boy back in the day. And, uh, I'm going to be looking into this, trying to see if I can find out a year or something on it, but it's really cool. But it's all, it's metal. And it has a wood look to it. This is probably one of the cooler pieces I've found in a long time, actually. But, um, yeah, I think that would be neat for somebody that, you know, really loved all that stuff as a kid. Oh, I should probably put that back in this thing. Alright, next. Oh, you guys are going to love this. It's going to be a throwback, kind of. Not quite. Not quite like the one I had last year, I'll think. 
but awesome anyhow. And she might need some glasses. I'm just saying she probably, I feel like she could use a pair of uh, like gold rim glasses, but I got, got to you Mrs. Claus here and uh, let's see if she's um, marked or anything. Yeah, she's marked here. Uh, it says collect. Oh boy. Let's see. Collect dolls, Inc. Collectible dolls, Inc. 1991 made in China. So what? 1991 though. So there's that. They bought her to make her. So that's what's important here. She's awesome, right? Lovely layers, and she's got her layer down there, and then she's got her pants down there. Just regular pants, not, you know, and her, her she's fully plastic, not like last year's that they buffed up and looked like it had been pumped up. So she's super cute, and she's movable. Look at her, yay. And her legs are not moving. <laughs> but she's super cute. I know somebody's gonna love her. All right. Now, this is where I'm like, OMG. I never, 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 ever found vintage Christmas in the wild other than at, like, you know, a flea market or a, um, uh, antique mall, but I've never found at a, at a store, at a thrift store. And here is a Santa mug made in Japan, marked there. That's an old sticker. The cold paint, of course, you guys know the red cold paint was always a problem. So there's like, you know, it's, you know, a little messy, but so cute. And I've got another one. So I might keep one just because, because I never kept, I never found a one on my own in the wild. And you can see it says Japan underneath, but so cute. And this one's winking. This one's not, see, so super cute. So I was very excited. And then I just got more excited as I went on. I couldn't even believe it. Now this, actually, there's another one like him, but, well, I'll hold him until I get, until I, see if I can find him. Now, yes, I feel like possibly, and I don't know until I do my research, possibly there were, were three of these. I don't know. They do have their Made in Japan stickers. Hallelujah. So there's your hallelujah, or your <laughs> Japan stickers. And then there they are. And they are, one is just holding a, what is he holding? Oh, his sack over his back. And then this one's ringing a bell. But I feel like these would have come in three. So I looked again. I went, I did like three laps once I found vintage. I was like, oh my gosh. So yeah, probably another one that exists originally, but you know, probably didn't make the lifetime. Then, oh, these are not Christmas, but you know, I'm going to sell them as Christmas decor. There are, and these are minis. You guys know, I always sell the big ones, but I got, I think four or five of them. Look how cute. Red design. Oh, I love my bubble jars. So there's one. There, and they're made in Belgium. There's two. You could use these for spices in your kitchen. Because the seals, I believe that all that I believe all the seals are are working well. Um, so there's three. And there's four. 
Now, I don't know if there was five or not. I don't think so. I don't remember. I think that were, there were only four. Then this, oh, so good. Now, obviously, I can't, I think this one played um, Santa Claus is Coming to Town, but I can't remember for sure. I'll play it. Yeah, it's Santa Claus is Coming to Town. And you would put, I guess you would put one of those like emergency size candles in there. But shit. Or they make the little mini red ones. I think that like even have the swirl, the tiny ones. Pretty sure. But I don't know if they still do. Anyhow, it's made in Japan. Got the little sticker still on it. There it is. It winds. It totally winds. I did wind it at the store. Um, again, I, well, I think there's just a little bit of cold plant loss on the package right there but not really badly. Um, yeah, just a little bit like over here on the side, but Santa himself, he is looking good. So yes, that's a good one there. This was one of the first pieces I found, too. Or well, maybe it was the second piece. I don't remember. Actually, I think I found this before I found the little Santa cups. But, um, and I feel like I got two of these. I don't remember. Anyway, his eyes, his paint is a little wackadoodle there on the one eye. But, you know, from a certain distance, he looks just right. But look at his paint. It is good, though. Like that little bit of blue in his... Are you okay? Jill? Yeah, I'm sleeping. Oh, okay. <laughs> a little bit of blue there in his beard. But there it is, Japan. It has a mark or a hole to hang. So that's kind of cool. Yeah, he could be a dish or you can hang him on the wall. this little deck of cards it has a readout made in china but you know i got these because why not yeah here's the the matching i mean i was like what this is made in China and has the sticker also, and it is not necessarily a wall pocket because it doesn't have a little hanging part, but look, it's like a little planter or something, or maybe you could put toothbrushes and stuff. You could use this in the bathroom if you wanted to, but they're definitely a, a set. Look how cute they are. He looks good. Handsome Santa. I mean, you guys, I, my Goodwill does not have, like, good, like, of these bags, usually. So I was like, what? <laughs> now, I don't like always, you know, to get a lot of these wooden ones, but I do know that I have people that love them, so I got some. So there's this little rocking horse. And then here's this big rocking horse. He's super cute. And they're in good, good shape. And this one says Bev on it. My aunt's name is Bev, Beverly. But, and the, oh. And there it says B something H. Oh, that's funny, my aunt's initials. Oh no, it says Bill on the other side. Bev and Bill. See, I knew it. This collection belonged to Bev and Bill. I knew it. So anyway, you could totally cover that up because it's dark anyway. Oh, now I'm sad. I don't know who died, Bev or Bill. Probably Bev because, you know, Bill wouldn't hang on to all this. Anyhow, this is Japan. Oh, so cute. Oh, I shouldn't say that, but, you know, I doubt that Bill would hang on to it. 
Then this is a little um, unicorn. I know a lot of kids like unicorns, so um, this, I guess they, Bev, Bev was creative. She must have made it be a ornament, but yeah, it's not really meant to be, but yeah, you do what you want to do with it. And then here's the main reason I bought it. Because it's got a flocked snowman. Yay. Little flock snowman has a little wear on his foot. But, um, so cute. So, so cute. So, there's that first package. I like these two. So a lot of this is going to be in sales, like tomorrow, today, today, tomorrow, whatever. Um, this whole week, probably. And then there's another one that I got that has this plastic horn. And then this flocked angel. She's the reason I got this on. Oh, I love her. Made in China, but she's she's an old China one. So cute. So if you like anybody music, if you have anybody musical, then there's that one as well. That goes with the horn. And then this is very windy here. This was made in Hong Kong. Little carousel horse. And then, cute little bell is green. It says inside, patent pending BR, what does that say? BR, oh, Bruce. Cute. There's that, that little baggie. I got another um, pink uh, little thingamajig or organizer thing. Then I got these. One says Noel and one says hello. And Jill gets either one or both of these. So she'll get to decide after she gets out of her coughing fit. <laughs> It will be her reward for surviving. <laughs> so there's cute little like hanging pieces. The detail is in, in both of these. So nicely done. Both of them are really nicely done. That's the one I wanted for her. So she's going to take hello so you guys get Noel. <laughs> Thank you. Mm -hmm. Oh, and this one, this packet, you guys, I didn't even open it. I just grabbed it. I hope there's, I hope they're good. I hope they work. They are these, um, wind up reindeer. I think they're gonna, I think they gonna, I think they're gonna, yes. <laughs> one is Donner. <laughs> I have Donner, Blitzen, and Prancer, and Comet, and Dasher. I think that's it. So, one, two, three, four, five. Five of the reindeer. I have names. And they wind up and they run all over the place. How many were there? Dasher, Prancer, Vixen, So, there was nine. Yeah. With Rudolph, there were nine. So, I have five. Anyway, they're super cute. Maybe you have five grandchildren <clears throat> and you want to get five of them. 
then I got these. These are um, 1982 Taiwan and um, they are like a little trivet or you could use them as like a piece of decor on the wall. Um, but you would have to probably do a new thing because these are missing. So this one has only missing one of his little feet. But there's that. Cute. And this one has all of its feet. Jasco 1981. Did I say that the first time? I don't think I said Jasco. And then this one. Cute. See, and they're marked on the back. And that the little hangers are not on this, but this one has all its feet. And then this one I think is the cutest. Is this one has um uh what you call it? Um the little kids trying to sneak a peek on Santa. And they are there. So cute. I like the colors. They're the, you know, 80s bright colors, too. So, anyway. Then I got another. I mean, I'm telling you guys, I can't even believe that I had these. So, now, you saw that I had that one, had that uh, carousel um, horse. So, here's another one. And I don't know if that was exactly like the other one or not. So, I will, I'm sure, uh, try to take a look. Uh, this one has an angel. Oh, 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 oh. Booty alert. And there's a mark on this one. I cannot see it. It's Hong Kong. So that one's made in Hong Kong. And then there's this little uh, felt. I mean, uh, flocked. Dove, so that's awesome for you know Christmas. Pretty, and then this is the reason I bought this bag. I mean, who doesn't love Santa? But he's holding a chenille tree. I love that. Oh, I love that a lot. I might have to keep that one. I like that a lot. It feels. Well, in, well, well kept. Yeah. So, there he is, and he's sitting there. Oh. In his okay. glory. So. <laughs> only a couple more items. This I thought was super cute. Now, I'm not sure of the year on this, but by the look of Santa, I'm going to throw it back a little to the 70s. Maybe the 80s, but anyhow. So this side is, is plain, so it's really just the front, you know, the front half of the tree. It would be pretty, pretty much. They had it folded just a little off ways. So, there it is. Oh, it's so cute. I think I'm going to be able to show it to you pretty good. Oh, it's so cute. So, you got your snowman, you got your reindeer, your, and then you've got Santa and his sleigh. Do you have one, two... Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah. You don't have Rudolph. This one's not all about Rudolph. So, but look, I'm just going to give you a close up on Santa because of his eyes. He's so good. Yeah. Very good. I like that one. This is that um, other coloring book <laughs> that has. Now, do you guys remember when everything had a price tag on it, even like at like Target and all that. It didn't have all the, you know, before all the readout, you know, the, this one does have the readout, but that could still be in the seventies. So Whitman, 
There's your 71 cent Target. But I don't think this one's too old. Um, uh, I don't know. It's in freaking Roman numerals. So it's an easy color book. So there's Waiting for Halloween. and Oh, I think it was like all kinds of seasons, this one. There's like a, a, a Easter duck and a mouse, frog and an alligator, you know, clowns, a horse, Humpty Dumpty, and a soldier or a drummer boy, whatever. Some musical instruments. Cute little elephant. Another stupid clown. Oh, a little kangaroo and a bird. Really cute. So cute little it would have been seventy it, oh it was seventy nine cents marked, but it was seventy one at Target. <laughs> Alright. Then and again I'm this I'm really surprised. I've never seen something like this. Totally keeping this. Um never saw something like this at Goodwill. And I got it for a quarter because it was marked 50 cents and it was yellow tag. So I got this for a quarter. I am over the moon and it is, I'm trying so hard not to, I got to show you the whole thing. I'm trying to get the sticker off and it's, it's working. Yay. Didn't take anything off. So it's 75. It's the long style. They are made in Japan. Christmas hangers. And if you're a local, it has a Treasure Island uh, price tag on it. Oh my gosh. That's like the best part of this for me. We used to call it TI. <laughs> anyway, very cool. Then I got this set of three. Not my jam, but I know you guys will like stuff like this because I know a lot of people like, you know, the snowman and snow, other snow critters. You know, I don't do snow. <laughs> so these are um, a set of three in the box. Here's the first one. They're little, yeah. There's the first one. And there's the second one. And you know, it's not ringing well because I'm holding on to it too. So, and that's the third one. Brand new. You could give somebody this for Christmas because they're brand new in the box. Gift Co. Made in Taiwan. And almost done. This big, big, um, not piece, pack, I'll call it pack. This is half off too, so I had to snag it. Um, big pack of, um, it's some brightly colored Christmas paper with uh, accompanying to and from stickers and oh yeah this um I got for well a combination it's just these broken pieces of um like Himalayan salt rock and this one I, I mean you guys I was like stunned so it's like this just must not happen at my. This is made in China, but this is an older piece. Well, and they have an older sticker that that was on there too. Um. Well, flock Santa. And last but not least, another baggie. that had this, which I'll be selling with the other one that I found. 
and this little sled, little sled ornament, and then this little, um, this bird, which is, it's hard plastic. It might have a mark on it. Let me see. No, no mark on that, but there's that. And then this last thing I'll be keeping. Eek. Oh, I love him so much. I mean, I never have found something like this at Goodwill. Never, ever, ever, ever in this world. So, yeah, good thing to end with. He's very cute. Anyway, that's it, you guys. That's uh, the end of part two, which was pretty good for, I mean... We could almost call that epic for a Goodwill haul. So, yeah, I'm very happy with what I got. Like, extremely happy for what I what I got. So, yeah, um, if you're interested in these pieces, either just uh, let me know. Or they might be in a sale today or yesterday or depending on what day you're seeing this. Um, because I'll be having a sale Monday and I'm not sure about Tuesday yet. And then definitely Thursday. I'll be having my sale Thursday, but I'll be having it early. So anyway, that's it, you guys. Thank you so much. Again, I'm just kind of getting back into the swing of things. So I don't know what day this will end up being on. But make sure that you give me a thumbs up and leave a comment down below. And if you're not already subscribed to my channel, please do so. It doesn't cost anything, and it helps my channel tremendously. And also share my channel with anyone you think might enjoy it. All right. Thanks, everybody. Have a great day. Bye.